What's going on everyone? Welcome back to Zoro Beats Terraria Part 6. We are jumping straight into it. Um, so a couple things to do today. Uh, last time we left off, we beat the... Oh, I'm in the desert. Last time we left off, we beat the Queen Jellyfish. We beat the... Yeah, we beat the Queen Jellyfish. We beat the Goblin Army. We beat Krabulon. Hive Mind. So we've got a couple of people left over. I, if I can get a, if I can get one of these suspicious looking eggs, we can do Leapus. But as of today, I want to beat the, maybe not the Blood Moon, obviously not the Blood Moon. The Old Ones Army, that would be an interesting one, but I don't know if we have, I don't think we have the Tavern Keep, so. So we've got the Old Ones Army, we've got the Dark Mage, of course. Uh, Viscount from Thorium, I think I need Blood Moons from that. Um, I think I need Blood Moons for the, uh, Unholy Shards, if I remember correctly. But, um, the next few steps is to probably go for the Queen Bee, then Skeletron. I do want to make some more NPC houses, because we've practically got ours filled up at the moment. So let's do that really quickly. So this should allow us to get some more peeps moving in, which is good. Uh, I need to remember not to use the single click. I need to remember that we're using the claws specifically. I'd say let's go down to the jungle and see what we can do. I don't know why Amadi Am Amadeus? Amadeus? I don't know how to pronounce your name. I don't know why you're there. Let's let's go over to the jungle. So yeah, let's go down into the underground. See if we can't find a hive. Because I'm thinking about beating Queen Bee today. But think is a strong word. Probably also want to try get some jungle spores. I think those will be helpful. Also, yeah, sorry about the lack of uh, videos and such recently. Um, there may be a few videos that I posted before this one, so if you see any of those before this one, then yeah. But um, I do apologize for the lack of videos in at times. Um, I've been doing a lot of stuff with the university as well as just real life stuff that's been taking over so I've not been able to stream, I've not been able to make YouTube videos, as well as just the general, you know, motivation and all that which affects me quite a lot personally. But other than that, you know, it's just one of those things. But I'm back now and hopefully I can get these coming out a bit more. Because it's been a while since I've been able to record one of these videos so I'm glad I've been able to now. Ooh, honey, we're close to, we're close. We are close. Honey is a good sign. I am full on max HP, so I don't need those anymore. Is that one? Yeah, that is. Okay, cool. So we found a beehive. Only issue is, you know, we need to fight her, which is a different thing altogether. And apparently the bee is after Skeletron, before Skeletron, I mean. So that may be a bit of a problem. But we could try it. We're on expert, so it's not master mode, so we're not going to suffer, but we may suffer a bit. So I'm just trying to build a bit of an arena here. Not anything too fancy. Just something to help me get by if, I, when I, if and when I do spawn the bee. Uh, obviously, I don't want to spawn her off the gate. So I'm going to try and be a little bit careful about this, because the spawner is right there. Never mind. Guess I don't have a choice. <laughs> Okay, guess we're just doing this now. Make sure to buff up. Okay, maybe she's not as bad as I thought she would be. Oh, she's kind of a bitch. Oh, never mind. Um, well, that was anticlimactic as all fuck. Wow. Cool? That was not what I expected. I will be very honest. I expected that to go much worse than it did. Guess I'm lucky, question mark? Oh yeah, I can walk on... I can walk on water and shit now. I'm Jesus! Okay, let's go home and see what all of this is about. My game is a little bit low frame rate, but it's fine. I'm not too fast. So let me let me keep the treasure bag. So everything else I think can go. Actually, the honey, 
The honey dispenser can go in here, I think, because that can help me make honey stuff. And everything else can go in there. Check what you give me. 40, uh, that's not that good, but I don't know if that'll help me summon bees. Yeah, I don't know if that has a chance to summon bees. See what the Dryad has to offer now. Oh yeah, the Abomination, yeah. Let's see if this actually does summon bees. Doesn't look like it. No, doesn't look like it. I don't actually know how many, uh, I don't actually know how much money I have, so I could probably reforge some stuff, but on the off chance I don't have a lot, I'm gonna not. So, we beat the Queen Bee, and that's good. However, we still got the Perforators to beat. Bloody Worm Food, I need Blood Samples, I need the cr I need the Crimson for that. So I probably won't be able to beat, but I kind of want to... I need the Grim Pointer, but I think I I think I have to craft the Grim Pointer. Never mind. Blood. I don't know who drops blood, but I need that to spawn the blood moon. Let's see how much money I've got. Uh, I'm I'm just gonna pop this in here and see. I have one platinum in savings. That's pretty good. Let's let's put this to Godly. Why not? and see if that does anything different for the damage. I don't think it will, but it's worth a try. So now I kind of want to go kill either Viscount or... Who sells the Grim Pointer again? I've completely forgotten. Oh yeah, the Witch Doctor's here now as well. That's good. Oh, I can just summon the Goblin Army now, the Witch is good. Yeah, I can make an anklet of the wind by myself. Oh, that's convenient as shit. What do I need for you again? Hold on, where's the guide? My. Okay, so now we can craft it the light ending boots, which... Oh, we got warding. Oh, that's cool. Warding's a really sick enchantment, actually. Well, reforge, whatever, same thing. Probably the best one that I could have got. So let me fish for a moment. I can just make the Terra Spark boots now. I will do just that, thanks. Am I dumb? Probably. Oh. I need lava waters. I think I can buy those too. Hold on. Oh, wait, I, I can make them though, can't I? Okay, it's nearly halfway through night time, but I kind of want to go see if I can try and beat Skeletron. Oh, I'm cutting it close. Um, get potions, potions, uh, potions, 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 I can make it. I can make it. You guys ready? Because I'm not. Buff up. Three, two, one, go. Okay, I need to dodge these. I need to wait until he's spinning, and then I can proceed with attacking him. I should be able to do this now. Come on. Spin, bitch. Wait. Oh, shit. Okay. Ooh, wee, wee, wee. Come on, I got this. <laughs> Scary. Come on. Hey, good shit. Let's go. Skeletron is down. The pockets of granite and marble in your world tremble. The first dryad's vines deem you worthy of their abyssal treasure. Okay, let's see what we get from good old Skeletroni. The amber hook is still better. <laughs> 
So I wonder if this will work. Oh my god, it does. <laughs> I didn't think that that would actually work. So we can now go in the dungeon, which is terrifying, but also cool. Okay, let's go... We can, we can go down dungeon, right? Here we go. Alright, golden key is needed already. I do want to try and at least get infinite torches at some point too, because I think I'm applicable to get those. Because I could probably craft them myself. This place is terrifying though. At least I've got the danger sense stuff on so I can see the spikes. Ooh, you are... Oh wait, I can just mine through this. Wait, hold on, don't leave yet. Okay, there's a golden key. Let's go get the one at the very beginning of the dungeon! Jesus Christ. I got another one. Hey, let's uh, go in this one, why not? Uh, that is a shiv. I don't want to shank anybody up, really. Sorry. Forgot how difficult the dungeon was. Oh, God. Okay. I do want to make a uh, mine thing for this at some point, because going down this like that every time will get annoying. Oh, the Muramasa. Yes. Let's go. Awesome. Don't need it, per se, but it's but it's useful. And the shadow keys, yeah, awesome, okay. Those are those are actually useful. Let's go back up to the top. Yeah, I'm just gonna make like a bit of a not a elevator, but I'm gonna make like a mine down so it's quicker to get through. Oh. Let's quick stack everything. Um I don't really need the Muramasa, it's not good, like, it's, it's alright damage, I guess. Um, I will put the Bone Wielder in the storage, though, so I can craft bone stuff. Can get more stuff from the Dryad, such as, I don't know, what is that unlock? Let's check what the Bandit has to sell. Tiger Climbing Gear, useful. Yeah, she's just mainly rogue stuff. Which is fine. I do want to go fight Count Dis uh, Discount today, so I'm going to search up how to fight him. Okay, the Confused Zombie. How do you summon this Confused Zombie? There is an empty house. Patchwork has been defeated. Shit, I haven't beat the Blood Moon. No, I haven't beat the Blood Moon yet. Oh, that's unfortunate. How do I get blood? <laughs> Hold on. Crafting and furniture that is dropped by our kind of certain enemies during Blood Moon, as well as biters outside of the event. As well as by biters, so I need it to be night time. Shimmy, shimmy, a shimmy, a shimmy, a. Yeah, seeing as I can't really get much else progressed on at the moment, I think I'm gonna end that here. Thank you everyone so much for watching. If you liked today's video, be sure to like and hit the subscribe button. It would mean a lot. I'm trying to get to hopefully a thousand subscribers by the end of this year, so that would be cool if you would hit the subscribe button. Other than that, thanks for watching. Again, sorry for the, all the lack of uploads. I've uh, been pretty busy, so I've been unable to do that. But hopefully I'll be able to get back into the flow of it. So, thank you all for watching. Peace out.